After almost three weeks of isolation, my conditioning and my overall fitness has reduced ridiculously. So I'm out for my first run for a little while, my first proper run for a little while. And uh, yeah, let's talk about it. This wave of COVID has definitely hit home a lot more than the previous two years. I'm not sure if it's the same for a lot of other people, but for us, COVID always used to seem like somebody that we knew knew somebody else that might have had it or it was always on the outskirts of our circles this recent spike in the r number or whatever they're calling it these days has definitely hit home a lot harder than the previous experiences we know family and friends who have had quite rough times actually with symptoms ranging from quite severe to mild and everybody seems to be having their own unique experiences with my partner working in a school it was very likely that she was eventually going to bring it home and if you can trust my wife to be one thing it's consistency so she brought it home for us jokes aside she contracted it and began her isolation and i was fortunate enough to be in a position where i could semi-isolate with her and try and maintain some level of health or stability or something in the in the coming madness that's what we were expecting anyway we were very lucky to, for her to have very mild symptoms she had a migraine on one of the days and she had a little bit of <laughs> sorry for that but she basically coasted through and on her final day of isolation she tested negative and we were about to cheer for joy just as my test tested positive and so yet another 10 day isolation began i was extremely lucky to be totally asymptomatic no headaches no nothing no anything so it just goes to show how scary it can be that people can go around in a pandemic and not even be aware that they had covid honestly i would have had no idea that anything was wrong with me apart from spending way too much time on the sofa watching movies, eating takeaways, eating junk food, generally not moving or doing anything at all, which of course affects your health in different ways. Anyway, COVID woe story over. I came out for a nice 5K run today. I genuinely did not want to get off the sofa. My legs were heavy. My body feels heavy. I've put on weight. My heart didn't really, wasn't really in it. I feel like I've lost a bit of passion for it all of the negative things that come with not keeping up with the le same level of conditioning but i'm sat there in my running kit saying to my wife oh yeah that was a good run trying to get away with it but well, she booted me out the door and off i go the idea was i wanted to do a nice relaxed run to gently break myself back in but after the first kilometer when the stats pinged up at 457 i think i thought wow i'm running a bit fast i better slow down I thought I'd slow down to about six minutes a kilometer, but second, second kilometer stats pinged up, 5.05 or something like that. I thought, oh my God, I'm on fire. I definitely have to slow down now, just so I can preserve a bit of energy. I did manage to slow down a bit for the third kilometer and then pushed out the, the final two. Now, as much as I'm happy with those stats, as they look on paper, it was hard. That first kilometer, I really, really thought it was, it was hurting, it was burning up. By the time the third kilometre rolled around, I had all the thoughts in my head. You know, oh, I could do a relaxed 3K, that's fine. Lots of people use 3K as a tool. I'm just breaking myself back in. I don't have to do a full 5K. But regardless, I pushed through. Kilometre four hit, and wow, wow. I, I genuinely think I'm a little bit mad because I just pushed through. At four kilometers, thoughts like, oh, I'm gonna need to leave some space so that I can do some vlogs on the way home. I better stop at 4K because then I can walk home and do a vlog. My mind was just screaming at me to stop running, but I endured. So to conclude all of that rambling, how easy you find certain fitness activities is all about conditioning. How much effort have you applied over the past few months how many kilometers have you put down how many different types of runs have you done have you mixed it up with interval runs long runs short runs and how well has your recovery been in between all of that all of those things added together equals 
an easier fitness journey. That's my conclusion anyway. So if you ever find yourself struggling, if you ever find yourself thinking, wow, this is hard, just know that as time ticks on, it gets less hard. Stick to your fitness plans, stick to your schedules, push through those few weeks of, of hurting, of uncomfortable, of not wanting to go out. Because just like me, I know I am going to feel amazing about going out in another two months. Uh, hasn't hit me yet, but it will. So with that guys, I wish you all the best. I hope you all stay safe and I'll see you on the next one. Life and love guys.